MM Kembler has been manufacturing copper tube in Australia for nearly 100 years and we pride ourselves on providing our customers with high quality products and customer service. We've combined our knowledge and experience with the latest German engineering to bring to the market a new universal copper press fit connection system, Kembler Chempress. Chempress is much faster and easier to use than conventional brazing. There's no flame involved, you don't need a hot works permit, and if you're doing some maintenance, you don't need to drain water out of the system. All the fittings are manufactured and quality controlled to meet Australian standard 3688. They are fire resistant and 100% recyclable. They are also guaranteed to work with other approved copper press fit tools. The Chempress tools come in two sizes, they're lightweight and they're electronically operated to make them very easy for you to use. This video provides you a step-by-step -step demonstration on how to use the Chempress system. Visually inspect the copper tube to ensure it complies to the Australian standard 1432 and then measure the length of tube you require and mark it. Using your pipe cutter, cut the copper tube to the length. Deburr the end of the tube on the inside and outside to minimise turbulence and pressure loss and to avoid damaging the O-ring. Make sure the tube is free from debris. When you are doing some maintenance and repair on existing copper tube, clean the end with emery paper or a soft scourer. Mark the insertion depth using a template and push the end of the tube into the fitting by rotating it until it reaches a complete stop. The outer edge of the fitting must line up with the marking. Or you can line up the tube with the fitting side by side and mark the tube that way. It's important that you make sure you have the correct fitting for the application. The water fittings have no colour marking on them and have a black o-ring. The gas fittings have gas printed in yellow on the fitting and have a yellow o-ring. Make sure that you check the fitting is clean and that the o-ring is free from debris and it's correctly in its place. Select the correct size pressing jaw for your fitting and insert it into the pressing machine and secure the locking bolts. Check the jaws are free from debris and in good working order. Open the pressing jaw and close it around the fitting so the raised bump in the fitting rests inside the groove of the pressing jaw. To make the press, it's easy. Just press the start button. And finally, visually inspect the fitting and your press is complete. And how fast and easy was that?